Erika Grimborg, uh, your team has been struggling in the last couple of games in the third period. Uh, how would you want to improve that tonight? Yeah, some games we have. Obviously, it was a tough schedule for us with four games in six nights. And even though we had a, you know, we, we got a point in each one of those games, we obviously felt like we, we didn't finish off a couple of those games. And uh, that's something we talked about and addressed, and uh, we need to get better at for sure. And we're slowly, slowly getting towards halfway of the regular season. Uh, uh, how do you see the first uh, half? of this regular season for your team? Well, I think like most people, it's been crazy. I mean, we've been sitting 20 days in quarantines, have been isolated, and it's been a really tough uh, schedule for everyone, and uh, myself included on the team, and it's tough for a coach to, to kind of plan ahead. And uh, we had, uh, in, in oh, I think it was like 30 days, we had 20 days of those in quarantine. And so it's tough, we get a practice schedule, it's tough to plan ahead, and it's tough to get a regular schedule going, but uh, that's the same for all the teams. And uh, somehow we, we need to try to find some kind of flow in it. And we had it for a while, we won uh, 11 straight games to three in a cup and, and eight in the league so uh, we know we can do it uh, now it's just a question of being knock on wood lucky when it comes to uh, um, sickness and, and, uh, and injuries and whatnot and how would you uh, judge the progress of the goalie situation after uh, 24 games well, I think it's a it's a good uh, fight between those guys of uh, who, who wants to be the f uh, number one goalie. Uh, I think uh, Weber has been uh, great when he stepped in for us. I think he's uh, made some some great stops, and I think Flood has been consistent too. And and again, whoever's hot's going to get the get the nod. And and uh, I think that's what you need to have. You need to have competition on all all uh, positions on a team. And I think uh, that's one of the competitions going on right now. Speaking of competition, uh, with uh, Chris Baldisberger is a very important person who is missing the rest of the season. Who's going to fill in this gap? You think? Well, it's a tough gap to fill because uh, obviously uh, Chris is uh, uh, playing a hard game every night. Uh, he's great in front of a net. Uh, he he get, you know, gets a lot of rebounds, and, and it's, it's tough to play against. And he's also an emotional leader in the locker room. So obviously, it's a big blow to our team and, and ourselves. But uh, we feel like uh, we need to step up when it comes to especially the emotional part, but also the, the physicality on the ice. So uh, yeah, it's a blow for our team. But again, everyone's uh, struggling uh, with injuries and, and, and uh, sickness during the season. So now it's up for us to to step up and, and uh, do a better job. Yeah, and the, I mean, in, in the power play situation, he's a very important uh, in front of the net. Is it time for uh, to try something new for Zurich now? Yeah, no, exactly. He plays a, um, obviously a very important role in, on the power play, but but also I, I think um, when it comes to the, the role he play in that line with Andre Ghetto and Rowe, I mean, he's a guy who goes in front of a net. He, he creates quite a bit of room for those guys. Um, so obviously, uh, you know, he's a first line player and a, and a first on a, on a power play. But that's another thing, you know, with the power play. I mean, it's hard. We haven't had practice now in almost a month and a half here, so uh, a real practice. So it's it's uh, it's been tough. We, you know, it, uh, when it comes to power play, it's a little bit of goes and waves when you're hot or not. And, and lately we haven't been so hot, so there's something we need to pick up. Uh, our PK on our hands has been really, really hot. We've been really doing a really good job then. And, uh, but, uh, you know, we need, to, we need to put some more pucks in the net when it comes to the power play situations.